Hey everyone, this is Adrian from PyImageSearch.com. Today I'm going to show you how to build a mobile scanner app similar to apps such as Genius Scan. Now, perhaps you've seen these uh, these mobile scanning apps before, but the general premise is that you know you have a piece of paper, or a, a document, a receipt, and you need to scan it. So you pull out your phone and you snap a photo of it, and then magically it's scanned into a PDF. Um, there's apps like Genius Scan. You've got TurboScan, and you got Scanner Pro. You just have tons of apps that basically do the same thing. They allow you to take a picture of a document and scan it into your phone. It's a really cool concept, but you may be wondering, what's the computer vision that goes into it, and how does it work? Well, that's exactly what this post is going to answer for you. So I have an example image here. I'm just going to pull this up. So the first step we're going to perform is edge detection. So over here on the left, I have a uh, piece of paper from Practical Python and OpenCV, uh, my computer vision book that I wrote. And the first step we're going to do here is perform edge detection. We're going to find the outline of that piece of paper. After we do that, we're going to find the contours of that piece of paper or the outline of it. Uh, then we can apply um, the slightly uh, longer step of actually applying the four-point transformer perspective warp and we're also going to threshold it um, to give it that classic black and white uh, paper feel. So here's the final result uh, compared to the original. Now the original is over here on the left and on the right we have our we have successfully scanned our piece of paper. Notice how the perspective has been uh, transformed to give us this top-down bird's eye view and also notice how we have a strictly black and white image now. You can see over here it's uh, not only is the perspective off but um, you have a lot of gray tones in the paper but over here it's nice and scanned and uh, looks looks all pretty. So to get a full review of all the code that, uh, that I have here uh, check out the rest of this blog post. I think you're really going to enjoy it.